we're here at the General Assembly building in London, helping our podcast listeners, followers, people who look for us on um, Money to the Masses website and who want a bit of an insight into how to build a champagne lifestyle for, with a lemonade budget. If you're a first time buyer and you're not sure if you can get on the property ladder, go and speak to a mortgage broker or a mortgage expert. Um, and they'll be able to run through how much deposit realistically you're going to need. There are actually some schemes that you can look at, so shared ownership and help to buy. Um, and you can start with as little as 5% deposit. So um, if you start planning now, it might not be in the next 12 months, but in the next few years, it could be something you can achieve. So the most important thing when it comes to budgeting is not burying your head in the sand. There's plenty of apps out there that can help you get a structure together when it comes to budgeting and, and find a way that works for you. Have one month where you just spend as you normally would. Then you can break down after that month to see what you're spending on each thing. That way you can then put as much as you want into your savings. You can see where you need to cut back as well. You can see where you're overspending and it will really help you in the long run. Open as many bank accounts as you can because in the UK banking is still free and if you open up multiple bank accounts what you need to do is when you get paid you move that money by direct debit or standing order into each account to cover your bills so you have one for your bills, one for your personal spending and you have one for your mortgage In that way you're able to keep an eye on each budget and make sure you don't overspend and more importantly that you actually pay all your bills. My best saving and investment tip is to start from as young as possible. The sooner you start, the greater the power of compounding, which means that your money will roll up over time and it will grow faster and faster in that snowball effect. When you get paid, make sure the first thing you do is work out how much you can afford to put away and stash it away in the best savings account. If you want to build a champagne lifestyle on a lemonade budget, you just need to be deliberate. So you need to work out what it is you want to achieve, whether it's to retire early or buy a Ferrari at the age of 40, and reverse engineer that so you know what you need to do today to achieve it. Don't pay full price for anything. The more you can save by doing your everyday spending, whether it's coupons, whether it's discounts, whether it's restaurant vouchers, that will really help you in the long run.